What's up, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Survival Fountain of Youth. Now, look, I want to show you something. I built myself a workstation. I have ourselves a carpentry mill, an improved workbench, some tanning and skinning stuff. Oh, and we built a log cart and a little wheelbarrow. It's way over there. Our little shelter is right up here. Got a rain catcher finally. Guys, I know in episode two, I like could not figure anything out. However, I realized there are trees that give you big branches and they look very specific. And I found one not too far on the other side of this hill. There's also a bunch apparently near the big tree. Now maybe that's significant for all the other big trees. I don't know, but I was wandering around trying to find rope or the, the stuff to make rope. And I found br big branch trees. Like, what the hell? And y'all probably already told me this, but uh, I'm usually an episode or two ahead. Now, we got to get to that goofy looking island. But also, we haven't done this tree either. I think I've got all the other ones. And then one of y'all said you could actually get to the top of the mountains and, and survey as well. So I don't know. Today's objective really is going to be we might make it to this tree and go ahead and survey because I haven't been to that region at all. But we're going to build our boat. I want to get to that island. However, there's a few more resources we got to get. I think I have enough to build the boat, though. Let's see. We've got all these wide leaves, big things. We have eight of these builder toolkits. So, I mean, honestly, we could build ourselves a damn canoe. Planks, sticks, bark. Dude, screw it. Let's get this. We have enough for planks. Bark's easy to get. Now... There was one thing I wanted to build, and I think it was this. It says a regular workbench, a durable needle. We have everything we need to do it, but I need that skin. Let's go. I don't want to waste any more time. Let's go to this tree. Also, <laughs> yeah, these things give you a lot more sticks than instead of just chopping them down. I'm stupid. <gasps> oh my god, what the hell is that? <gasps> oh no. What are you? Oh God, you're howling? Ah! Ah! Oh God, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh. No, you get your ass back here. I guess I only have one arrow. so many of them that hurt that thing was stupid what was it a jackal yeah come here you jackass you're mine it doesn't know what to do <laughs> idiot There's so many. Mom and dad are angry. Okay. Jackal fangs. Jackal meat. An animal is hunting me. I cannot do that. What animal? That sucks. A chicken. Dang it. Let's, let's get out of here. Let's go back to this tree. If I see another one of these uh, big branch trees, I'll, I'll show you what I'm talking about. They're very kind of specific looking. <gasps> Look at all these stupid little dog things. We gotta take him out one at a time. Oh my god. I'm gonna die out here.
I'm too impatient for this kind of stuff. Oh, the tree's way up here. Should probably be getting ourselves bark. How much was it? 15 bark. 15 flipping bark. Eight. Got plenty of sticks. Those little briar bushes help. These things. Is it that guy? He's coming in hot. Let's just keep going. I want to cut this down. Oh, it's going to be dark soon. This game, it does not give you a lot of time, though. The days and nights are very, very short. <gasps> Book of the Hunt. Well, we did one of these two. Written by one of the best hunters of the 14th century. Describes the habits of various types of game. Hunting for this game. Hunting methods and different weapons used. Huh. We just take it with us, right? Vine bush. Isn't that what that is? Oh, it's a jackal. <gasps> There's a couple of them out here. Where's this tree? Oh, crap, he sees me. Yeah, you're mine, you jackass. Oh my god, he sees me too. <gasps> oh, crap. Oh, crap. These things have much better awareness. I don't- crap. Trying to get on one on one? Come on, jackass. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Oh my god. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna have to go back. <laughs> I can only faint six times. taking some of these critters for granted i thought the birds were stupid and the dogs were dumb those jackals uh they want to eat your pee pee <gasps> what is that i didn't see that oh that's my stuff <laughs> take all and i guess we can eat some dates gonna make us poop I don't see him over here oh <gasps> look at that rock uh oh where the jackals go I was ready for round two oh I don't have you Son of a bitch. I don't have any rope. Yeah, come on. Come on, you little a-hole. Oh, I think I... I backed into the tree. Crap, man. 
I came all this way. <gasps> What's that? All right, what, what do we need? What do we need to build this stupid boat? Just a little bit more bark. Come on. Ah! They scared me? And how much weight can I carry? Like six more pounds. I'm gonna take both of those. Oh, here we go. I needed to find those. Yeah, we definitely could have just come this way. Why is that changing? I don't like the way that sounds. <gasps> okay, I don't need a rear back for these guys anymore. It sounds like something's coming after me, don't it? <gasps> There's water right there. Do I have a canteen? I don't. That's okay. Goal. Ain't oh! Oh! Yes! Can I drink that right now? No, let's wait. Oh, there's one of those things. One of those jackals. I want to get better at it. We're being hunted, dude. What is that? We got clay. Oh, crap. And a snake. I don't have any more. Oh, my God. Come on, you jerk. Come on. I'm gonna die again. <laughs> He's still flipping got me, man. All right, build that up. Don't have enough weight. I'm actually carrying too much weight. Let's uh, let's drop a coconut. Oh my god, I'm still carrying too much weight. Oh, I bet that weighs too much. All right, let's go check out what this is. And let's get back. I want to build a boat. This looks interesting. <gasps> it is interesting. Oh look, what is this? Coal. Yes. And I got a, a bone. Oh. Piece of a native map. Would make this better if I found a rope. What about more bones? Here we go. Song of the Wrath of Mortals. It was not long before mortals realized who poisoned the wells, and hatred for the immortals blazed up more than ever and awoke a terrible rage, which was destined to burn the immortals to ashes. Horrible was their hatred as they were poisoned and devoid of healing. Weak were their bodies, but their spirit craved for death of their enemies more than their own living. Casting away everything else, all mortals went on the great hunt for immortals and there was no island befallen, no stone unturned, no cave unsought, and all immortals were found, and most of them slain in bloody battles. For there was no limit to the rage of the poisoned, who found their poisoners, and the last of best people fell in the year of high sun, defeated by the rage of sick and dying mortals. Dang. 
That should be a rock song. So, I feel like I'm picking up all these arrows. I don't know what I'm saying. There's so much over here. We gotta come back. I gotta come back anyway so we can map that tree. I hear one of those jackals. <gasps> there you are, you son of a bitch! <gasps> ah! Oh my god, I'm gonna die again. Yeah, you you better die. Ah. We'll come back for you later. Alright, so now I should drink the living water. Yes. <laughs> this stuff got real real quick. Like, I was sitting here thinking, like, yes, this is great. It's a survival game. But then I was like, maybe it's too easy. And then I died by a jackal. Oh, what's up here? Is that bones? Let's check out swimming. makes you stronger does not satisfy thirst but I'm guessing I'm gonna need that at some point I guess before we'll build a boat and before we go out we'll go back up there we'll map the area and we'll fill up our canteens with water first things first we gotta build a dock Where's that at? Special building for mooring vessels must be installed in the water. It's better to attach docks to the foundation pierce. I don't really know exactly where I want to put it. I'm thinking... I don't know. Right here? I don't know if I'm doing this right. Oh god. Place this there. It's gonna take 26 minutes, 17% chance of injury. Okay, well, how long does it take to build this? It's gonna take us right at two hours to build that. So, let's go sleep. Okay, let's uh... Let's go build our dock, build our boat, possibly make one more trip over to that big tree. Maybe get some more food. I need to, uh, I need to build a drying rack. That's something else we got to do. So I can start drying our food. Especially if we're going to start island hopping. Fill our canteens up. Fill our food up. Let's go. Oh, I forgot about this. I'll oh, see, like, I didn't even need it. Not yet, anyway. You know what else? I'm kind of stupid. Look at that. I'm gonna get rid of these. I don't really need them. Unless for some reason... No, look at that. Our canoe should fit just fine. Let's see. Crafting. A ship. It's going to take us 12 hours 
to build this ship. Let's make sure. Oh yeah, look at that. Plenty of disbursement. All right, so we need two half planks, six sticks. Make some planks. Oh, I need my saw. And let's make rope. Look at that. It's going to take us 12 hours to build this ship. I don't know why these are numbered. I kind of don't like that. What is that? I can improve it. I just don't like that it's... I don't, I don't like that it's numbered. It's kind of weird. There we go. Oh, one more of those. Let's spend, let's do four hours working on it. Let's go. Oh, I'm going to be, I'm going to be dead energy wise. Let's go here. Sweet. I know, dude, we're going back. Inventory. Eat, drink. There we go. Now we can like fully recover. I'm gonna have to sleep though. Look. And again, guys, I'm sorry if this thing keeps popping. I, I have that stupid pop filter, but I delivered it to my work, and I keep forgetting to bring it home. That's it, right? That's all that's left. Booyah. Wait. Oh, I broke our axe. Crap. I can't repair that either. Oh, wait, yeah, you can. I thought you couldn't repair it once you broke it. Look at our energy, man. We unlocked a blueprint. Oh, look at that. We already got to go back to sleep. So tomorrow, we're going to go back to that tree. Gain as, gather as much resources as we can. And then that way, that way we can sail. We will sail that island in this episode. Let's eat. And go to sleep. Eight hours. We're gonna go ten. It's still raining. I don't want to go out in the rain. You get all soaking wet, and then your guy gets a cold. But I don't want to sit here and do nothing either. I wonder if I should try to make another coconut flask. All right, it's about midday. We can make it. Surely there was an easier way than that, right? <laughs> like right there. Okay. Build a rope. Are you serious? Oh! 
Dude, if this dude comes after me. All right, well, at least I can get him now. Thank you. Now, map. Oh. I feel like I've almost mapped this entire island. I bet. I bet I need to get up there to finish. There's something up there. However, we've got things we gotta do. That trips me out every time. And let's fill up on water. Sweet. All right, so we're gonna get back up here. We're gonna cook this food. In the morning, we'll build a food dehydrator and set sail. I think. I hope. Um, what do I need to build a drying rack? Two rope, two planks, four sticks. I need a saw. I'm gonna have to spend one more night here. It's like already noon and I don't want to set sail at noon. I'd rather set sail in the morning and give myself plenty of time to prepare. Let's see crafting, machines, I need the four sticks. There we go. Have an ax. Gonna put that right here. Forty minutes. Ooh, what we get? A two compartment. Oh. So I can only put one piece of food here. Oh. What is this? Oh. How do I get sea salt? Oh my god. Well, that's not what I thought it was going to be. Fair enough. I guess that means we're going to take these things. There were two eggs. All right. Let's go see how much storage we have on our boat. Maybe load it up with coconuts and some crabs. We'll sleep one more night because I'm a chicken. I'm afraid to go over there at noon. I feel like something bad is going to happen. But we'll see what we can put on our boat. Oh, a lot. Go ahead and put our water on here. That's pretty cool. That's a lot of weight. It's a lot more than I thought. I need a chicken. Gotcha. Just gonna put him in inventory. We're gonna be like Maui, except he's gonna be a dead chicken that we put in our boat. Boat snack! Boom. We'll put our, uh... Oh, see, look at that. We're gonna sleep full seven hours. Oh, we are set. Grab some breakfast. Maybe. Let's eat a coconut. We're good on food. Oh, guys. Let's go. Let's go sail. That says start fishing. Take the helm. <gasps> Look at the durability on this thing. Oh, no. Fish. <gasps> this is flipping cool.
Dude. Oh, no, we're going. Sorry. <laughs> it's like we're really pirates. That was really cool. Probably completely pointless. I just wanted to show you guys my skills. This is really flipping cool. I don't know why I like it so much. We'll need to, uh, we need to build a fishing pole now. Sailing doesn't take too long. I do want to check this out. That's like an old canoe right there. That just sits there, right? Okay. <gasps> oh, what is that? Portable beacon? What does that mean? Throw it on the ground to mark a spot amidst red smoke. Oh! I'll keep that. Anything else? Oh, there's a crab! Haha, <laughs> you suck, sir! suck this is a kind of a cool little island though like this would be an emergency halfway point possibly build a small camp here might actually camp out here tonight let's go i think we did good though we did good building this boat it's got a lot more durability I really like that feature. Like it makes you feel like you're really, oh God, I love it. I feel the water splashing in my face. Let's see. Okay. I, I took a hit from what? Like I'm tempted to, uh, right? I mean, I'm not, I'm not a pirate, but wouldn't you do this in real life? Like, wouldn't you try to put your boat in something like this to protect it? Yes. Like this is what you would do, right? I get eaten by something. Don't tell me that's not what you do. You have to cove your boat. What is this? Just oh, it's just a, <laughs> a big giant log. What is that? You see that? It's like something floating right there. Like a sea monster.
Uh. <gasps> oh. Oh, we could have landed right there. Dude. What is <gasps> an old box? It says put it on our shoulders. Like, what? I don't know what we can do with that. I know the other one allows you to go into the inventory with it. Oh, scrap. Oh, dude. An old barrel? I don't know what you can do with all that stuff. Oh! <gasps> Was that the cannon of okay we got more medicine sansa Mer cannoneers note oh god i can't read that my name is blasco ribeiro i am a cannoneer on the expedition led by juan ponce de leon in 1513 a.d our ship a caravel named the sansa maria was shipwrecked and thrown into the rocks located one day north me and our cook pedro Left to scout the surroundings and, if possible, find an island more suitable to live on. Survivors of the wreck, survivors of the wreck, Santa Maria, are continuously firing cannons as a signal. But I'm afraid that the only remaining cannon will not last for very long. Our lifeboat crashed against the underwater reefs near this rock, and we had to swim here. When we reached the cave, Pedro slipped on wet rocks and broke his leg. We have run out of supplies and are starving. I will now leave Pedro in the cave down below, and we'll go up. Maybe I can catch one of those birds circling up there, or at least find their eggs. If Pedro and I do not make it and die here, please pray for us and take care of our bodies. Dude! Can we take care of their bodies? They decomposed really fast. What is that? <gasps> A movable container that holds liquid. Prevents liquid loss from evaporation. It can hold... Oh my god, yes? Can we take that back to our ship? Probably not, but it'd be worth a shot, right? I'm gonna run through here and get step on a scorpion. Ooh, pineapple seeds. Yes? I'm picking those up. You're ready to travel to a new region? Unknown region. Oh, wait a minute. To go on expedition to this region, you need to be at the helm of the ship and have one of the following. 5 of 15, Spanish way, or learn the blueprint for a better ship. Hey, what about this one? 5 of 10, we can do it? Oh, we can go there. We can go to a whole new region. Guys, you know what I'm going to do. We'll go to another region. And if it's awesome and looks big, then we will gladly, gladly build a base there. We'll build a base on every island. I promise. I'm just too excited. I just wonder uh, how long it'll take to sail there. Explore the top level rock. <gasps> this guy's been picked clean. Oh god, they're gonna come at me at the same time. <laughs> ah! There's three of them! Nothing. You have an egg. But how many eggs do you have in your nest? I need an even number. Oh, look at that. It takes six minutes to get eggs. But it takes five minutes per feather. Oh, what is that? <gasps> oh, God, that scared me. <laughs> this is the cannoneer from the crashed Santa Maria. Left without a boat on this rock. He was dying of hunger. What about thirst? Up on top, he found a nest and tried to grab some eggs. 
but the cannoneer underestimated the danger of these birds. The harpies. And the harpies oh my God. picked him to death. Maybe somebody else survived on Santa Maria. I should go to the crash site. Dude. That would suck so bad. Let's go to a new region. I'm excited. Oh my god, it's gonna be dark when we get here. Oh, there's a flipping look at that, a metal axe. Oh god, it is. It very, it very, find the Santa Maria. View the document. Um, shipwreck and thrown under the rocks located one day north. Doesn't really help me out, does it? There's something up there, though. Oh, <gasps> there it is. I'm stupid. There's something up there, too. This is so cool, guys. Oh, yes. It's like we're the Goonies. Except cooler. This would suck though, dude. Imagine. Oh. I mean, it just like perfectly got lodged into this thing. <gasps> dude, what if we can go back and get our stuff? Remember in the beginning? Wait. I don't remember what boat we were on. What is that? 10 hour, oh, sailing. Yes. The captain's log would be in here. Right? No. Searching the captain's cabin. Search the ship for the key. Can we sleep on this ship? Coffee seeds. Crap. Crap. <laughs> I left the damn sleeping bag. Oh, <gasps> what is that? Iron rod. Can be used as a lever. Oh. Can I? Okay. Pile of scrap. Gotta find the captain's key. Yes. Oh no. How do we light? We don't have a torch. Forgot how to make a torch. Oh, I didn't think I was gonna work. What is that? Flint? Oh, wow. <laughs> A barrel required. Search the cannon in the hold. Shoot the cannon in the hold. <gasps> Can I sleep? No, dude, let me sleep. I'm stupid, I left my stuff. Oh, what is that? Wood chips.
Look how intuitive this is. Okay. But I gotta find the barrel. Dude, I like this. Everything just sticks, though. <gasps> Cannibal. Gunpowder bag. Where's the damn barrel? Rope? Rope made of skin? That gave us something. Oh. A smoldering bag. I have not found the barrel. And why does it say shoot it? Oh. Oh, dude, this sucks. Maybe up there? How do you lose a cannon barrel? Beyond it? Just check in, make sure there's nothing else over here. Good God Almighty, imagine carrying this thing. We're gonna have to make it through the night. Oh God. I think we'll be okay. Place the gunpowder, place the cannonball, burning torch required. Required item. Okay. Here we go. Oh. That was really cool. Is that a jug? Captain's key. Maybe the captain's quarters has a bed. I mean, this ship's in really good condition. I don't know why everyone's dead. I mean, they've got lifeboats. Like, in really good condition. Or at least enough condition to get off the ship. Like, look at that. But they're all dead. Something else must have happened. Or there better be something else that have happened. <gasps> oh, look, I can't sleep though. Wait. Yes, I can. Look, I don't care. I'll take it. I'll sleep, no problem. The logbook of the Santa Maria. Captain of Santa Maria and his mate are killed. It looks like the killer took them by surprise. But who, who could have done such a thing? And most importantly, why? Dude, there's a on guy, the he table, killed everybody on the ship. There is the Santa Maria's logbook, stained with blood. Apparently, the killer looked into it. I must examine it at once. Okay, the Santa Maria was shipwrecked on the rocks. Thank the heavens. Part of the crew survived the shipwreck. As agreed with the leader of the expedition, we are sending signals daily by firing the only intact cannon. 
The first mate told me that most of our supplies have been ruined by seawater. We'll have to send someone in search of islands where we can get some food and fresh water. In the end, the cannon could not withstand such frequent firing and broke. Furthermore, it cannot be repaired until the cannoneer returns from the scouting mission. Our leader survived. Captain Ponce de Leon arrived at our location today. He followed us by following our cannon signals right before the cannon broke down. And more good news, the same cannon signals were heard today by the big island not far from here. And that means the San Cristobal survived the storm and is anchored somewhere there. Bad news, still nothing heard from the cannoneer and the cook who left to scout the islands. Why would you send the cook? Juan Ponce Leon is true to himself. His seemingly unlimited energy has greatly inspired us, springing us into action. After a short discussion, we have come to a decision. The captain will take all survivors to the big island on lifeboats. A couple of men and I will stay here for a few days and wait for the cannoneer and cook to return, or to confirm that they are no more. Then we will join the others on the lifeboat left for us. We see another lifeboat on the horizon heading our way. It could be either our scouts or another survivor. Oh God. There's a murderer? Find Copper Island. What's this? <gasps> yes? Marine binoculars? How do I use those? Uh oh. Journal. I'm selling my diabolical invention as, with its help, I have seen that my death has been foretold in the stars. Royo Falerio provides information about distance to the items under markers and increases marker visibility radius and concentration mode. 50%. Bonus always works. I don't understand that. Oh, look at this. If I build these things, I get points. Again, I didn't see any of this stuff. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna base camp here. What is this? Oh, <gasps> yep. Pile of scrap. But nothing else. No beautiful chest to open up. It's okay. We're gonna sleep. Let's drink our coconut. Let's eat our food. That's really cool that we can sleep here, though. But we have a wind chill that kind of sucks. That's a nice bed, though. We got a lot of sleep. Alright guys, let's try to find an island to land on. Ooh. Big branch. Oh, we're packing on the weight though. Forgot how we got on the boat. What is that? That looks like a boat. Or a temple. We gotta find cut so what I guess we have a Oh my god, stop it! We got like a region of islands. We gotta find copper island. Hopefully build a base camp. There's something big up there. You can see it. We're sailing to something right there. There's something up there. Oh my god, yes. This looks like uh, the thing we built a base at before. Kind of. Maybe. I can't cheat the system here. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Oh, it's so cool. Where's that? 
Hasava seeds. Ooh. We like in an, we're like in an observatory or something. Interaction with the lamp. Tegu skin. What'd that say? Tegu skin flask for crafting. What's a Tegu? What can I do with this? You'll last a very long time. Oh. That's kind of neat. We don't have any fuel right now. They got really quiet in here. I like that. Alright, so we got stuff right there. There's something up there. Well, I guess that means one of these is Copper Island. I don't know which one I should land at. There's something up there. But there's stuff right here too. Like... I don't know. Let's... Let's sail back. I wanna go over here. There's something over here. Oh, it's spinning. What is that? It's like a windmill. Location unlocked. Do we have a map? Like a local map? <gasps> we do. Santa Maria, Red Island. Oh, that's supposed to be Copper Island. Oh, God. I wasn't paying attention. Help. Help. Let's anchor. That'll work. It is windy and hot. Oh, this place sucks. This place probably isn't going to be worth it. But it'll be cool to visit. Oh, yes, it's really cool to visit. Wind chill appeared. That kind of sucks. Oh, this is really cool, though. <gasps> like a whole civilization here. <gasps> What's that? Hut made of leaves? We can sleep in it. Energy, sun protection, water protection. We can sleep in it, but it's too damn windy. Rope. Didn't even know we were coming. What is that? Is that aloe? Agave. Obsidian. We're gonna have to like make stuff. We have to like build a little workbench. <gasps> I want to stay and explore, man, but this place is like brutal. There was a rope down there. Let's go up to this windmill area. Maybe we can get out of the wind. It's about midday. Stupid bird. Definitely a lot of resources, though. What was that? <gasps> I heard something. Oh, God. There you are, you little shit. Get out of here. Nope, get out of here. Let's go. <gasps> Let's go. <laughs> no, you get your ass back. Oh, my God, he turned around. I just realized he's already rigor mortis. 
meat, hide, bone. Or just leave that for now. Dude, look at this place. Oh yes, there's a cave. We have shelter. We got runny nose. Aloe. Got a stupid bird. Oh, his nest is right there. Agave seeds. I'm telling you guys, we're in an advanced civilization. We just found Atlantis. There's a floating coconut. Can't go in here. I guess there's not much to this island. I'm not going to complain, but... Can't go in there. Wait. There you can. The a big log in here. That thing is just rolling. Short-eared dog broke. Let's drop that. That sucks. The crabs are breaking. Everything's breaking. What is that? More agave. Got a blueprint out of that. But I don't know what it is because it didn't tell me. <gasps> oh no. Our navigator, Diego Nunez, arrived here to study winds. He was in the middle of his studies when the killer caught up with him. Looks like the first shot only wounded Diego. He tried to escape, but the second bullet killed him. The poor guy didn't even fight back. What kind of monster could do such a thing? For real? All right, that sucks. But, magnifying glass. I don't know what that means. I know that you sincerely believed, as I do, that the Earth is round, and I think you can help me prove it. Signed, Fernan Magellan. Unbreakable fire starter, plus 30% chance of ignition. Can be used during the day in clear weather, but not in the shade. That's kind of cool. So, like, emergency. We need fire. Oh! <gasps> Can we go up that? Before we do anything else, can we go up this? It's a flipping dude hanging there. God, man. Oh, I didn't see any of this. Oh, no. What is this? Like, what did we just find? So far, this is probably the best survival game I think I've played. Other than, like, the forest. And Sons of the Forest. But it's intricate. It slows you down, and it's got a really cool story. What is that? Mushrooms? So, let's give this, uh... Let's give this, uh, magnifying glass a go. Let's try to light this torch. Oh, wind penalty. Uh oh. Yeah, I might not need to do that. Can I light it with this? 
What? Ah! Okay, stop it. Son of a bitch. God, man. I burn myself good, too. Statuses. It blocks quality of sleep. A 30, almost a 30% chance of getting worse. Oh, look at my water consumption. Or is that because I'm hot? I wouldn't even paying attention, guys. This sucks. Oh! <gasps> I'll take that. I was just trying to light my stupid torch. Dude. What's this? It's got a bull. Vanilla. I can place. Uh oh. Treatise on the science of weapons. Throwing effects. Yes. Dude, we got so much we gotta read. We're gonna have to go back to our first island, man. And just recover. At least there I have I have tobacco there. But we're gonna have to back up. Oh. Look at that! What are you doing in here? I wonder if I can scare him away with this. Oh god, there's multiple. We're gonna die in here. Shysta. Come on, you little shit. anything I'm gonna flip and die in here I don't know what happens if I die in here it looks like I finally figured out the mystery of this cave judging by the rock paintings the natives worshipped a unique tree found deep in this mine the tree grew in the middle of poisonous fumes and people are only able to breathe when standing under its crown having named the tree a miracle the natives began to build a temple around it they found a way to dispose of the poisonous fumes by constructing sewage pipes. The temple became the main sanctuary of the natives for many centuries. However, at one point, an earthquake had apparently partially destroyed the temple and broken the pipes. Everyone made in everyone inside the temple is dying from poisonous fumes. The tree also withered after that. The cave and the island with it began to be considered cursed and the natives abandoned it. I was not exposed to these fumes for very long, so I think I'll be fine. I will continue my research after a short break. There might be some valuable findings in this cave. Yeah, I need uh, bandages. Oh no, man. Are those the fumes? A stone door key. Oh my god. I don't know what I need to make a band. I gotta build a fire. I don't have any leaves, but I have some food. And, oh, I don't have any water. That's okay. We're okay. We're gonna survive. We're not gonna die. killed those stupid dogs 
with a torch. Uh oh. <gasps> oh god, I made a mistake. Oh no. Oh, there's another effing dog. I'm gonna flip and die. Oh, thank you. I can't. I can't do that right now. We got more stuff down in the cave, but we've got to recover somehow. We put a fire right here. Shut up, you stupid snake. I don't need you coming up on me. Bones, obsidian. All right, the winds have died down. Crafting. Go fire. Oh no. Why can't I put it in here? Can I build a bed in here? <gasps> no. Why won't it let me build a bed? I mean, I think there was a bed out here, right? But it like gave me a massive wind chill. Oh, dude, he ran a long way. I mean, I guess we're gonna have to sleep in this. I've gotta sleep. Okay. We did that. I know we have coconuts on the island. Let's, uh... Yeah, let's get back to our boat. Let's try to go to this other island, see if anything happens. This one just... Ooh, what is that? I did not see that guy there. We can just cut this down? What is that? Oh, <gasps> yes. We're going to save that, though. We're going to save it unless we absolutely need it. Okay, guys, we're going to go back to our original island. And we're going to recover our health. I honestly don't know where I'm going. All right, we took care of that. I got lost for a second. Oh god, I got a runny nose times two. Yeah, let's go back. Let's go back to our original island. Let's recover, and then we'll come back to all this stuff. This is neat, but we got to be prepared for it. Oh, our uh. Our burn went away. That's good. That was nice. Saw how good that was. Nice and smooth. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I think we went on quite the adventure. It sucks that we had to come back to our main island, but we got to prepare. I wasn't ready for that. There were a lot of, a lot of jackals. And a lot of dangers that, yeah, I wasn't expecting. The strong winds, the high temperature. We just got to be prepped for it. So, thanks for sticking with me. And remember, if you do enjoy this content, please smash that like button. Leave a small comment. It really helps out the channel. But with that, guys, gals, stay frosty, stay mad. And I'll see you all in the next one.